Uh, you have, uh, you know, you reached out to us. You have a FBL uh, Turkey Ball tournament yes, coming yes, up. Yes. Uh, explain the details on that and. So, ayun, uh, uh, well, of course, part of Crossover Sports Canada is to be able to uh, uh, manage events. So, isa sa event na uh, we're trying to have is the uh, Filipino Basketball League Turkey Ball. So, we're gonna hold it in uh, Hope Dome. So, mm -hmm. we'd like to uh, invite everyone, all Filipino ball clubs, to register now. It's available. Registration mm -hmm. is available. We're gonna have a team leaders meeting very soon. We're just finishing the Naba Intercity yeah. and everything. So, after that, Crazy turkey basketball ball. again oh. for the Thanksgiving yes. turkey ball. Uh -huh. It's happening in Hope Dome. Uh, what do you hope? What do you hope to achieve with the the turkey ball? Like my my kind of goal, kaba para sa you know. For the turkey ball, kasi we if you look at the history of turkey ball, mm -hmm. there's so many turkey balls happening. Eh. There's one in Mississauga. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. There's one in Hamilton. Tapos what we did is. We had the all age group, mm -hmm. so wala kaming add even. Oh, mm -hmm. So ang goal don is for everybody to be able to play mm -hmm. at their own ano don sa tamang edad nila. Unlike mm -hmm. other previous tournaments, yeah. na minsan kung ano ka mas younger you have to play up. Yeah. Now for FBL Turkey Balls, same pattern ng recently successful na Filipino Basketball mm -hmm. Youth League. Mm -hmm. There's no age group. No, I mean oh. I mean there's an age group pero for each year. Meron tayong division. division. Oh, I see. That's so, what walang ano ngayon. Walang There's dalawang no age. Up. Yeah. Oh, so, everybody can play at their, ano, sa tamang oh, edad. Oh, that's different. So, that's, 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 that's yun ang isang difference. Mm -hmm. And of course, it's the same thing. It, it, we, we look at the turkey ball as another way of uh, friendly competition and where people can enjoy the games. Kasi mm -hmm. nandun lang eh. Nasa hoop dome eh. Mm -hmm. so, so, lahat nandun. So, you don't oh. have to go to other schools. Yeah. Yeah. So. <laughs> Talking about enjoying the game, when will you feel that you have, like, what will be your most exciting moment for these kids that you brought back home um, in the future, I guess? Actually, every step is really, ano sa akin, uh, eh, I'm really yeah. excited of what I'm doing or mm -hmm. what we have been achieving. Uh, of course, to see them really play yes, first time dun sa big stage, mm -hmm. uh, NCAA or UAP, yeah. that would be really nice. Talagang sarap ng feeling siguro nun. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm looking forward to it, actually. Uh, we have two players uh, who had a very good chance of making uh, uh, Team A. I mean, they already made Team yeah, A. Yeah. You, ben Kwagukome would play for USD. I think mm. he'll gonna be the starting point guard. Wow. And then Evan Sanjago will be playing for your UP. Oh, so yeah. uh, come this season, yeah. so yeah. I'm, I'm hoping that uh, they would be able That's to play. That's the first step. Yeah. So, step, pag binisita nyo sila, yeah. I heard you go talk yeah. to them. So, make sure you visit them. Yeah, visit we'll talk to them for sure. Yeah. Okay, that's, hey, that was a fun interview. I wish we could talk to you more. Yeah. Um, but Coach Mike will be at all the tournaments at NABA especially. So, if you're a parent or if you're a, a kid looking maybe to think about playing in the Philippines, why not approach Coach Mike? Familiar face, very approachable. 